voice of controversy, it was that time of year again. Swanee's birthday. Now, not another birthday. Didn't you have one last year? What's a birthday? Oh, forget it. Go put on your outfit. Oh, yay! I couldn't work out what to do for Swanee's birthday. We'd already had a petting zoo and a jumping castle, and last year's mud wrestling was a disaster. And then it hit me. I'd get Swanee's favourite singer to perform, Michael Jackson. <laughs> ah, he doesn't seem to be answering. Gee, I hope nothing's happened. <laughs> Meanwhile, the Silvertail was trying to get back in people's good books by going to join the boys in Afghanistan. But he couldn't even get through the training. <laughs> oh! oh! <laughs> You're in Ruddy's army now. With the silver tail taking himself out of the game, it was time for me to celebrate and go on my old favourite show, Robbie. I was hoping Robbie would be in his little penis suit, but he only wore that for Bruno. I thought Bruno was brilliant, so I decided to do my own gay Austrian character. Hey, Robbie, I'm Kuno. I like to put watermelons in my backing passage. Uh, isn't that a rip-off of Bruno, Mr Rudd? I had Google Sacks for breakfast. <laughs> Twitter time. Hey guys, I'm backstage at Rove. My interview went really, really well, but I'm busting for the toilet. I can't find the toilet. I guess I'll just go up against this wall. Hey, has anyone heard from Jacko? I hope he hasn't fallen off a cliff like Richard Wilkins thinks everyone has. Gotcha, Dicky. My gay Austrian character was a hit, and I had to stay in character everywhere I went. Well, little girl, would you like my G-string as a souvenir? And me and my party coordinator, Hans, came up with the perfect idea for Swanee's birthday. A gay-themed lederhosen party. Happy birthday to you. Enjoy the leather shorts. I sewed a little cock on them. <laughs> I'm shy. And a, bit, a big thank you to the Prime Minister's Twitter time during the week for those who are on Twitter. Now, Tony, you hadn't seen my little uh, knitted penis before, had you? The little doodle. My little doodle. <laughs> I can't so, believe um... you went that far. That is commitment. Well, it's not commitment when you fake your G-strings ripped off you when your little fake penis pops out. You didn't, you didn't know he was going to wow. pull it off? No, no. Better you bet you thought you'd never say that sentence again. Well, I, I wish I had. But it's like you've got to be careful, of, you know, when you've got a knitted penis. Um, <laughs> read the washing instructions because it's prone to shrinking. <laughs> so you've got to be very careful. <laughs> All right, we are running drastically over time. Got to take a break. We'll be right back with what we've learned and short stack. <laughs> <laughs>